just warmed my heart to see him happy. Although in the video, you don't see him smiling because he's wearing a mask, right? But when he smiles, his eyes kind of scrunch up and go small. So I knew he was just smiling behind that mask last night. Despite the Winnipeg Jets losing their game on Monday, fans can still reflect on that night positively because of something that happened in Section 117. It was Hockey Fight's cancer night, and Winnipegger Dean Green was having a dream night with his favorite player. Dean has been battling cancer nearly his entire life. Dean's only 12, and he's been battling three different cancers for about 10 years now, and you know, and he's never given up. He's going through so much physically, you know, mentally as well, but he always manages to smile. He always manages to make us laugh. Sidney Crosby FaceTimed Dean this spring after Dean's mom, Rachel, made them both matching beaded necklaces. Due to the pandemic, Dean couldn't meet Crosby face to face Monday, but the stars aligned to make a magical moment happen. A family donated four tickets to the Dream Factory that happened to be right beside the Penguins bench. The Greens had dinner out before the big game, and their server gave them a nice surprise. She introduced herself and then she said Sydney and then we just looked at each other right away and you know like you know I like it was a coincidence but you know sometimes I don't believe in coincidence I think they're just meant to be. Once they were rinkside Dean went to the glass in hopes his idol would recognize him. He wished to get a puck from Sydney Crosby. And we didn't know it was going to happen, and that's exactly what happened last night. In the video, you could see Sidney Crosby looking right at Dean, you know, to throw to give him a, a puck, and you know, it, was, it was a good catch too. <laughs> She's not kidding. A snapshot shows the exact moment Crosby recognized his biggest fan. A Jets fan submitted a video also catching a snapshot post-game from the other side of the rink. It shows Crosby sticking around to give Dean a farewell salute. For Rachel, this night is an everlasting memory. Dean's actually in palliative care at the moment. And, you know, we're just making memories and enjoying what we have with Dean and, you know, and he's still hopeful. I mean, he's got a lot of faith. The Winnipeg Jets donated $150,000 to Cancer Care Manitoba and put on a display for all those bravely battling this disease. It was very heartwarming. Um, it was emotional. I was emotional, you know, to see those stories of these children battling cancer and, you know, and beating cancers. As Dean continues to try and beat his cancer, he's got a message for his pal number 87. Thank you, Crosby. Thumbs up. <laughs> In Winnipeg, Mike Albanese, City News.